Hello, everyone. Welcome to the class. Can you hear me? Hello, good evening. Good evening. Hello, How good evening. Miss. Good evening. How Hello, Miss. How are you doing today? Si me escuchan, can you? Evening. Si se escucha, can you hear me? Good evening, yes, 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 miss. Yes, yes. miss. Thank you. Thank Fuerte, you. claro. Loud exactly. Loud and clear, remember, loud and clear. Loud and clear. clear. Good, good, good. So welcome again. Thank you very much for being here. I know we're happy because it's Friday. Finally, finally Friday. And we're going to have a break, right? We're going to have Saturday and we're going to have Sunday. Maybe you work um, on Saturdays, but maybe you work only half day, right? Or you work the whole day on Saturday. All day or just half day? Half, half day. Half day. Half day. Half day. Okay, perfect. That that's 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 better. So maybe we're happy because tomorrow it's Saturday. So if we don't have a full day of work. Well, I don't work tomorrow. So I'm gonna wake up late tomorrow, hopefully. <laughs> Sometimes I say that I'm gonna wake up late on Saturdays and I wake up really early. I don't know why that happens to me, but it happens. So welcome and thank you very much for being here. I know sometimes we want to be on a party, we want to be with friends, we want to go out and do things, right? But we're here because we have a goal, right? And the goal is to learn English. And I appreciate the effort you are doing every day to connect to the class and to be here with us, right? Okay, so uh, we're going to continue today with the topics we have been discussing. Actually, today we're going to see a little bit of a present perfect, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we're going to see a little bit of present perfect. We're going to study this topic. We have studied this topic before, but we're going to do like a review these days, okay? The present perfect to talk about experiences and things like that, okay? Now, um, before we start with the class, as it is, I'm going to start with the attendance. You know that we always have to go with the attendance. So I'm going to start with that now, okay? Remember to say present or I'm here. It doesn't matter. Uh, wait a minute. Today is Friday 14th. Okay. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Diaz. Present, Miss. Okay. Denis Enrique Saldaña Claros. Present. Blanca Isabel Tunaca de Rodríguez. Present. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Present. O sea, si no, no, va a cambiar, no va a cambiar la lista porque yo era de los últimos antes. Sí, pero ellos, así como me la dejan, yo tengo que dejarla. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, no Bless you. O sea, thank you. Oseas Figueroa Cisneros. Present, Miss. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Rafael Antonio Martínez Navarrete. Present, Miss. Eric Enrique Reyes Martínez. Present, Miss. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Walter Vladimir Martínez Rosa. Walter? No? Okay. Mayra Patricia Artiga Vázquez. Jocelyn Angelina Ramírez Melgar. Present, Miss. Johnny Alexander Escobar Calderón. Present, Silvia Patricia Seituno Méndez. Present, Miss. Mónica Wendy Ábalos Girón. Present. Okay. Johnny, oh my goodness, you're a cartoon. Yes, miss. <laughs> hey, <está bien>, ese efecto. <laughs> he looks like a cartoon, right? In metaverso. How did you do that? 
Avatar. With an avatar. <laughs> it's funny. Maria Julia Ramos Olivar. Maria Julia Ramos Olivar. Present. Okay. Angela Guadalupe Hernández Sánchez. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Se parece el avatar de Yuni. <laughs> Igualito. Um, Sandra is not here. Okay. Julio César Aguilar. Present. Jennifer Esmeralda Maya Arias. Present, Miss. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present, Miss. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present, Miss. Gerson Alexis Funes Sosa. Gerson hasn't connected to any class. Omar Seth Galicia López. Present, teacher. And Amado Javier Urrutia Rivera. Present, Miss. Okay, perfect. We're missing a couple of students today, but I hope they connect later today. Walter, I see him. He's connected, but I don't know. He's connected. I think I think he's connected, but I don't know something. Okay. Anyways, as I was saying before, thank you very much for being here. Thank you very much for your punctuality. I know it's Friday and sometimes we want to be doing other things, but I really appreciate and I admire the effort you are doing to be here in the class to learn a second language, right? And thank you for paying attention to me because I know that's one of the most important things here in the class, right? So before we continue with the class and the topic we have for today, I would like to ask you, have you or did you do any exercises on the platform these days? Yes. Yeah. Some of you, you have been working on the platform? I start. Okay. Yes. Start. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. That's good. That's good. Perfect. I was asking this because you know that besides the minutes connected here in the class, this is your attendance. The other 50% of your participation in this course is the work you do on the platform, right? So it's 50-50. You have to be connected to the class. That's part of it. And then you have to be working on the platform. That is the other part, right? Got it? Yes? Yeah. Okay. Remember, as I told you before, ya les he dicho este ejercicio, se lo voy a decir de nuevo. Vuelven a ver para arriba. Vuelven a ver para abajo. Eso, si le hacen así, yo voy a entender qué significa que sí. Si vuelven a ver para la derecha, después para la izquierda, eso significa que no. Ok. Lenguaje universal. Right? Y si, if you want to say, I don't know, you do like, hmm, hmm, right? Shoulders up and down. <laughs> That's it. Right? Johnny, oh my goodness, your your bird. It looks like it looks like your bird. It's real, Miss. Yeah, oh my goodness, that avatar is pretty real. It looks like you. Uh, oh my goodness, yes, it looks like Johnny. <laughs> Se parece. Yeah, a lot, a lot. It looks a lot like you. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gonna try to do it later. <laughs> Okay, perfect. Yeah, he has to take a picture of it. Okay, perfect. So we're going to continue with today's class. And as I told you before, we're going to practice. Practice because you already know how to use the present perfect. Do you remember what is the present perfect? You don't. But we have learned this topic. You see, I use the present perfect there. We have learned this topic before. We have practiced this topic before. This topic, we use it to talk about experiences. Yeah? With the past participle, I have watched a movie. I have played soccer before. You have, uh, I don't know, you have bought a house. So the present perfect is the one that we use with have or has, right? And the past participle of the verb. We're going to look into it. But before we go with that, 
we're going to start with a question, okay? And the question we're going to go with is this one. It's on the page 12, number 12, okay? So the first question, we have a couple of questions here, one, two, and three questions. The first question, Johnny, can you read the first question for us? Yes, miss. Have you ever heard this information from online? Thank you, Johnny. Next question, let's see, Ana Veronica. Can you mention the name of three product lines? Excellent, thank you very much. Let's see now, Silvia. How do you pur purchase any product literally? Lately. One that, uh, lady, one that belongs to a famous product line. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, you guys. So yes, we're talking about product line. So the first thing you're going to do is you can go online and look for that specific concept, right? The specific meaning of those words. Product line. What is a product line? So have you ever heard this expression? If you haven't, you have to go online and look up for it, okay? The next question says, can you mention the name of three product lines? So once you know what is a product line, you're gonna be able to mention the name of three product lines. And then once you know this, you're gonna tell me if you have purchased, okay, what is purchased? Compra. Yeah, like buy, right? Have you purchased any product lately? One that belongs to a famous product line? So we're gonna answer these three questions. If you don't know what the meaning of this is, you can look it up on the internet and then you can give me the examples. Uh, if you can take a screenshot and send it to the WhatsApp group, I'll appreciate it, okay? Do you understand the activity we are doing in this moment? It's only translate. Not translate, look it up on the internet. And I'm asking you to look for the meaning. You can look for the meanings in English as well, okay? Okay. And then Thanks. tell me the three names of three product lines and if you have purchased any product line lately. Uh, but uh, three product lines, what lines? That's what you're going to look for it on the internet. Okay. You're going to look for it and then you're going to know. <laughs> Ahí tenemos las invitaciones para que nos podamos unir, porfa. Let's go.
And who is the major? The, la the last Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola, yeah. Soda. And Coca-Cola. Manual is manufactory. Manual is manufactory. Okay. Manufactory. Manual is manufactory. Manufactory noise a production series. A line okay. production. Yes. Our final production noise. Noise the line production. Line product, product, the product shoes. line. The shoes is uh, is industry. It's industry, is industry yes. and manual manufacturing is does not belong. Eh, eh, también es hecho manual, artesanal, los zapatos. Yes. Uh, in in my country, in my country, yes. Ah, excuse uh, me. Too. Ok, entonces voy a compartir esta, la, la, disculpen, hoy sí ya lo están viendo. Sí, yes. sí, sí. Ok, Thank what you. is a product line? A product line is a group of related products all marketed, market under a single brand, a single brand name that it's sold by the same company. For example, the cosmetic product like a shampoo, a conditioner, and two in one product, okay? <coughs> so this is example. Cosmetic también puede ser una línea de maquillaje para mujeres. Ajá, uh -huh. okay. And uh, makeup, makeup uh, line, product, oh my God, for the Women. Así sería. For oh, women. Sí. Creo woman que si pone woman. woman. Si pone woman es plural. Es plural. Tiene que quitar el de. Solo sería for woman. For woman que para las mujeres mm. o para la creo, mujer. Creo. I'm not sure. Okay. De ahí el, la siguiente sería... The plural is women, the singular is woman. Ok, ah, thank pues you, al Miss. Revés. Ah, al revés. Women, <laughs> okay. like M-E-N. E-N. E -N. Yeah, and a conditioner, Come conditioner. is conditioner, not a conditioner. Ok, conditioner. Correct. Conditioner. Yeah. And two and, two and one product. ¿verdad? que es el que tiene champú y acondicionador. Son tres productos diferentes. Exactly. Have you, you purchased... Hello, Omar. What happened? The internet? ¿En qué sala hola, estaba? Hola, hola. ¿Qué sala estaba? Dice que no logré ver, pero ¿dónde estaba? 
Alicia. Alicia. Ajá. No tenemos ninguna Alicia. Yo me acuerdo que Alicia se llama la, la doña que, que estaba Mario. con nosotros. Este y también estaba ahí un compañero de tiene el pelo algo largo, no me acuerdo cómo se llama. O sea, ah, vaya, estaba en la 1, ya lo mando. Gracias, Ticho. Mayra, welcome to the class. Thank you, Miss. You're working? I am driving right now. Only Oye. listening. Okay, so I'm going to send you to a group just so you know what they are doing, but then we come back, okay? Okay, thank you. Be safe. Okay, practice your answers, two more minutes, and we come here to share the answers with the group, okay? Two more minutes, and we come share the answers. Practice.
Hello, welcome back. Okay. So, we're going to share the answers. What happens? Where are the other participants? What happened? ¿Y los otros? Three, 22 students. Oh, oh my God. Now, now it's here. 23 with you and 22. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see them. I can see them now, but I couldn't see them at the beginning. At the beginning, I only saw like 10 students. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, now I can see you. Okay, Jose Alfredo, bon appetit. Okay, so now uh, we're going to share the answers, but before we go and share the answers, I would like to tell you something. So, so there it has happened to me twice, yesterday and today, okay? So I ask some students when they, I don't know, they have problems with the internet or something and they connect again. And I ask, ask them, who were you with? And they say, I don't know. I don't know who I was with in the group. They don't remember the group. And they always say twice, twice, this, 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 yesterday and today, with the guy that has the long hair. So who do you think that is? Oseas. 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 <laughs> it's always like that. They said the guy with the la the long hair. So and I say, oh, that's Oseas. <laughs> and then when they don't Osea. know, then, then no, then Osea, Osea. <laughs> Osea. I cut my hair. But yeah. they say the guy with the long hair, and I'm like, oh, that's Oseas. You lose your, your no. power. <laughs> Oh, he lost a bet? No. no. And, then, ah, and, then, vale. and then sometimes... Ya estuviera pelón, entonces. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. yeah, he will. And then sometimes when I ask them, who were you with? And they don't know the name. They say, the guy with the strong voice. The strong voice. Who is that? Ramiro. <laughs> exactly. Yo soy el hombre de la barba. They say that, but they also say that. But I, I, I did it. When, they saw it, when they said that, I was like, what? I don't see it. I don't see it. But I think they, they, they oh my God, I don't know. They related the, 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 bird, the bird with the with a strong voice. I, I believe that's what they did. So yeah, that happens sometimes. So anyways, oh, and do I have a, do I, do I have a student named Alicia here? Monica, no. your other name is Alicia? No. No. No, okay, yeah. No. I don't remember I have a student with it. Veronica name. Burgos, no, no. Yo me acuerdo haber visto una Alicia, de cierto. Yeah, the, but, but I don't, I don't see it. And they said Alicia, Carlos, but it's like Alicia. Se fue al país de las maravillas, mis. Ya yeah, en Carlos, María's look alike son, right? Yeah, Carlos, we miss Carlos. Oh my God, yeah, Carlos, Ana Vero. No, 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 Ana Verónica is here. Verónica Burgos, this the one that is not yes. here. Ah, la que la que tomaba. Acobo. Tequila, todo, todo. Acobo. <laughs> it's true. We missed a lot of students this time, well. Yeah. Such a shame. Rafael, there you go. We see Rafael today. This happens once, once in a while. That doesn't happen very frequently. So say hi to Rafael. Hi, Rafael. Uh, nice to see you, Rafael. Rafael. <laughs> yeah, like Jocelyn. Jocelyn, too. Jocelyn and Julio. That happens with them. Oh my God. It's like if you see them once in a curse, that's that's something okay anyways out of the topic we got out of the topic now let's go back to the topic let's see your answers let's go first with the group number one eric maria julia mayra monica Oseas, rafael and walter siempre se parece a a miguel este rafa 
No, you relate ah, them. Fal falta no, you relate them. You relate them. Even. ¿Quién comienza? Ok. Um, the first question is, have you ever heard the expression product line? The answer is, a product line is a group of related products all market under a single brand name. That is sold by the same company. Uh, can you mention the name of three product like uh, like Nike and Puma and Coca-Cola? Pudiera ser cervezas también. Virus, la constancia. The next, next, Mayra. Okay. Have you purchased any product lately? One that belong to a famous product line. We have both shoes, Nike and Marushan soups. Exactly. Just a correction. It's not bought, it's bought. Okay, so we have bought. Like this one right here. Let's see. If it's yes. This one, right? Bo th. Bo. Oh. Yeah. But yeah, correct. Okay. Anyways, good job. Excellent, everyone. Thank you for Thank your you. participation. Thank you. Okay. Now let's go with group number three. Ana, Denis, Jenny, uh, Jocelyn, Julio, Ramiro, and Silvia. Oh, you know, también está Jenny's. ¿Se acuerdan de Jenny's? Jenny's, sí. Ya no la tenemos. No. She's not. Okay, let's go. Excuse me, product development, what is a product line? A product line is a group of related products or marketing under a single brand name that is sold by the same company. Can you mention the name of three product lines? For example, the cost the cosmetic product like a shampoo, conditioner, and two and one product makeup line product for women, beverage product like a beer. Have you purchased any product lately? One that belongs to a famous product line? Yes, we purchased a product for clean the body. Uh, make make the uh, pet only and the uh, uh, five day bill. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you for your participations. Excellent. Bueno, me andan ayudando a aplaudir, ¿verdad? Sí. Aplaus. Yeah, good. Excellent. Mi papá puede tirar cohetes así que así. But I cannot. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. Okay, let's go with group number two. Javier, Blanca, Eric, Johnny, Jose, Alfredo, Oscar, and Sandra. Let's go. Means I was probably and don't write nothing. You didn't write nothing? Yeah, you can share what you have. If you want to speak about what you were talking, it's okay. 
just talking in different products and 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 comparate in the artisanal artisanal factory but and in industry and products it in the industry products is different okay and for example nike potato lace Carl's Park is is the uh, industry production series the the most famous uh, on that below to a famous producers line is Adidas, Nike, for example. So you're a different food. Yes. The fabrication is car production series. Okay. Okay. Thank you. No. Appreciate it. Well, look, I found the fireworks. Look. Now I can do fireworks. Look at here. Fireworks. ¿Sí lo ven? Yes, miss. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, I wanted to ask you something. So, first of all, Nike is not Nike. When you say Nike, my mind is like... Nike is Nike? Is Nike. Nike. Sorry, it's Nike. Yeah. Nike, I don't know. Nike. Nike. Nike, <laughs> Nike doesn't Hyundai. exist. <laughs> Nike doesn't exist. Okay. Yeah. Adidas, 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 Adidas. Okay. Yes. No Adidas, Adidas. Okay. Adidas and Nike, Nike. First one, right? Yes, don't remember. I'm sorry. Toyota is Toyota because that's a name. I don't know. That's Japanese or something like that. Toyota. That's how they say it. Toyota. Toyota. <laughs> Toyota. Toyota. And then Nike. The first name is Toyota. What is it? It's Hyundai. The, the family created the mark is Toyota. Toyota. Yeah. Toyota. 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 Yeah. The name is the name of the family is Toyota, but the name of the company is Toyota. Toyota. Yeah. Now. Remember, Nike. Don't say Nike. Don't say Nike. It's Nike. Nike, right? Right. That's that's something that we have there because I, I heard a lot of you saying Nike. Okay. Anyways. I, I repeared the, the chip. Bueno. Yeah. Reset it. Reset it. It's Nike. Yeah, reset. Nike. Nike. Nike doesn't exist. Okay. Now, let's look into other thing. So, a product line... It's very different. Well, it's the same, but at the same time, it's different than a brand. You got it? It's different than a brand. For example, Honda, it's a brand, right? Honda is a brand. Civic is a product line. You got it? So. Yes, the brand is a specifically one thing, and the product line is the specific line of those type of cars they produce. For example, you were saying Industrias La Constancia, okay? That is a brand, that is the company, yeah? But what is the product lines they have? They have Coca-Cola, they have Pilsen. Pilsen. Mm. They have what else do they have? Cristal, yeah. water. water. They Golden. have water. They have yeah. Yeah. Anything. Any love. Any things. It's love. Industrias la Constancia. So to yeah. identify the different product lines is the different lines that that brand sells. For example, Nike. Yes, Nike is a brand. But can you mention some product lines of Nike? Jordan. Jordan, that's a famous one. Air, uh, Air Force One. Air, Air Force One. Air Force One. Air Force One. Okay, uh, what else? Supreme. Okay. Is that, is that Supreme. Nike? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Collaboration. What else? So then we have, for example, let's think about other 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 brand. Hmm. Coca-Cola Company. Yeah. There is Coca-Cola company as well? Yes. Okay, okay. Fanta? 
like Fanta. Uh, Fanta is, is a light. Right. Now, let's think. The right. one that we have that is very Salvadorian, Salvacola, right? Pepsi. Yes. What do they have? Bicola. Cola champagne. champagne. And that, I will say that's the most famous product line they have, right? That's yes. cola champagne. Like if you think about pupusas, you think about cola champagne. Padejo. Pupusas go with cola champagne. And they are a match, right? <laughs> okay, excellent. So that's the difference. I want you to think about that. That's the difference, right? We have the brand and the products they have but the specific product line is something in a specific. For example, Toyota Corolla, right? That is a product line. Toyota is the brand and Corolla is the product line. Let's, line. Think, let's, line. Let's, let's think about line. another one from Toyota. Yaris. Land Cruiser. Yaris. Land Cruiser. Forerunner. Forerunner. Okay. Prado. Land Cruiser Prado. Prado. My Prado goodness. High looks. High looks. Oh my God, Ramiro. You only Tacoma. mentioned the, the most expensive product lines of Toyota. <laughs> and I was with the Corolita. And Ramiro is like Land Cruiser. <laughs> okay, perfect, perfect. Prado, I said. Prado, yeah, he said Prado. He said Prado. Yeah, he did say it. Yeah, he did say it. Okay. No, that that's an Bradford. It's all a brand. I like the Radfords. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so yeah. Now, do we understand what is a product line? Yes, yes. I, I understand. Perfect. Thank you. Very, very good. Now, let's go with this conversation we have here. Okay, so here we have the conversation. This conversation. If you pay attention to it, they are mentioning, oh my God, what did I do? Wait a moment. Here we go. Ah. Okay. So uh, they are saying, and if you see the letters in bold, the words in bold, they are talking about the present perfect. Okay. This is present perfect. Now, let's listen to the conversation. Then I'm going to explain a little bit more about present perfect. It's a topic that you know already, but we're going to review the topic again. So it's pretty clear in your mind, on your minds. Okay, let's see. Dad, I've decided to launch the new Papa's Sandwich. It's going to make, remember you can say it's going to make, it's going to make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's burger, Papa's fries, Papa's salad, Papa's chicken, etc. Come on, young man, have you lost your mind? But that, our clients love every single product we've come up with. We have always sold everything we offer. Besides, I think it's about time for a product line extension and time to open a new brand. Branch, branch. If you say so. But I don't want to hear you complain about having so much work. And I'm not working overtime. If you think it's going to work, it's going, it's going to work. Oh my God. It's missing the two. It's going to work. I should say. It's going to work. You're probably right. Okay. Do you need me to repeat in a specific pronunciation or tell you the meaning of something? What does it mean in branch? Branch. Branch is, for example, um, how can I say this? For example, when you have a business and you have the principal offices, like the headquarters, and then you have different branches in other, de other departments. Is the separate the office or the separate the operation? 
both can be separate operations or separate offices. Okay. So for example, in that in Spanish, we call it Casa Matriz and then? The words are. Correct. Okay. So another one. Nothing? Uh, yes, miss. Uh, best sites. Besides. Besides. Is like. I don't know how to say it in another way. But in Spanish, that would mean aparte de. Ah. Besides. O oh, además. Or the, además. además. Yeah, además too. Por otro lado. Correct. No one is asking this, but I will tell you. Come up with, this is a phrasal verb, okay? These three words, they have just one meaning. Come up with, we come up with. Con lo que hemos dado, okay? Like, like con lo que hemos inventado. Think of product we have come up with. Okay, something else? Unido and they say that that I be decide. Decided. The first I've decided. This is the abbreviation for have. I have decided, mm -hmm. like I've decided. Yo he decidido. Correct. I decided to launch. Launch. Okay. Already. Product. Product. Al, what is the pronunciation? Already. 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 Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna read it one more time and then I'm gonna send you the audio. Dad, I've decided to launch the new Papa Sandwich. It's gonna make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's Burger, Papa's Fries, Papa's Salad, Papa's Chicken, etc. Come on, young man, have you lost your mind? But Dad, our clients love every single product we come up with. We have always sold everything we offer. Besides, I think it's about time for a product line extension and time to open a new branch. If you say so, what is the meaning of if you say so? Si tu dices eso. Okay. Exactly. Or if you put it in Spanish, si tú lo dices. Si tú lo dices. Sí. Exactly. But I don't want to hear you complain about having so much work. And I'm not working overtime. If you think it's going to work, you're probably right. Okay, I'm going to send you the audio. Dad, I've decided to launch the new Papa San. It's going to make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's burger, Papa's fries, Papa's salad, Papa's chicken, etc. Come on, young man. Have you lost your mind? But dad, our clients love every single product we've come up with. We have always told everything we offer. Besides, I think it's about time for a product line extension and time to open a new branch. If you say so, but I don't want to hear you complain about having so much work and I'm not working overtime. 
if you think it's going to work, you're probably right. It's then you guys. When I send you the audios, it's for you to listen to them because then I go to the break rooms and I hear you mispronouncing. What is mispronouncing? Se pierde la pronunciación. Pronunciar mal. Ah, okay. Thank okay, so you. We don't say bad pronunciation, we say mispronounce. Okay. So, and I hear you mispronouncing the words. And remember, I ask you, hey, do you have questions? I can repeat and I can say it again. And also, I send you the audios, okay? I send you the audios because I want you to listen to them. And if you have questions or if you have the question for a specific word, you can look it up on the internet, right? Right? So, I don't want to hear you mispronouncing. This time and this specific moment in the class is for you to practice your pronunciation. Got it? Got it. Yes, got it. Correct. Okay. So remember, we go to the breaker rooms. We go there to practice. To practice. This is your time to practice, specifically your time to practice. Wait a minute. If your breaker room is not working, they are not speaking, okay? Please let me know so I can move you to another breaker room. Let's go. Jenny, did you get the invite?
Hello, Eric, what happened? Saliente. Yes, hoy, hoy sí estoy yo. Okay. I decided to launch the new Papa Sandwich is going to make our brand, brand more popular and captures more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already, Papa's Burger, Papa's Fries, Papa's Salad, Papa's Chicken, etc. Et Come on, you men, have you lost your mind? Success is your charm. I start? Yeah. Okay, Dad, I've decided to launch the new Papa's sandwich. It's going to make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's burger, Papa's fry, Papa's salad, Papa's chicken, etc. Come on, young man. Have you lost your mind? But Dad, our clients love every single product we've come up with. We have always sold everything we offer. Besides, I think it's it's about time for a product line extension and time to open a new branch. If you say so, but I don't want to hear you complain about ha having so much work and I'm not working overtime. If you and I'm not working overtime, if you think it's going to work. You're probably right. Thank you, Julio. Thank you. Very good start. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm Alejandro. Dad, I've decided to launch, uh, to launch the new Papa sandwich. It's going to make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's burger, Papa's fry, Papa's salad, Papa's chicken, etc. Don't mind them, man. You love your mind. But that our clients love every single product we come up with.
Hello, welcome back. So let's do the conversations. Listen, and I wanna say something just really quick. I wanna say congratulations and I wanna encourage the job of some groups because when I went to some breakout rooms, some people were not practicing until I got there and they heard the recording in progress and they started practicing. But then I went to some other breakout rooms and they were practicing since I got there. Before I got there, they were practicing and that's really good. Remember that this is your time to practice and as much as like, if you practice more, you're gonna learn more and your pronunciation is gonna get better, okay? So that's very important that we please uh, keep on practicing because not only one, two, three times, as many times as you can, okay? Yes. So let's go. In my, in my, my group, only three people and only three persons participate. Only three people participating? Yes. Okay. Okay. Well, in that... our group, all the people participate. Excellent, Ramiro. Okay, good. Well, that's good. You know. Thank you the... for the classmate. Yeah, thanks to the classmate. You remember, as much as you practice, that's going to be good because that's your pronunciation that's going to get better. So if you don't have classmates to practice with, that's why you have to let me know. Hey, I cannot practice because my classmates are not speaking or something like that, okay? So let's go with Blanca and Dennis, okay? Uh, Blanca, you start. Okay, done. I've decided to launch the new Papa's sandwich. It's going to make our brand, brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's burger, Papa's fries, Papa's salad, Papa's chicken, etc. Coming on, you man. Have you lost your mind? But that our clients love every every single product we will come up with. We have always sold everything we offer besides. I think it's about time for a product line extension and time to offer a new branch. If you say so, but I don't want to hear you complain about having so much work and I am not working overtime. If you think this going to work, it work probably right. Okay, excellent, good job. Thank you very much, appreciate it. Just give them an applause. Excellent. I'll just, some corrections. Decided, come on, single. Okay, just those corrections. Besides that, everything was good. Okay, let's see. Let's go now with Rafael Martinez and Mayra Artiga. Rafael, you start. Okay. Okay, miss. That I decide to launch a new Papa sandwich. It's going to make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Me? Yeah. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa's burger, Papa's fries, Papa's salad, Papa's chicken, etc. Come on, you mom. Have you lost your mind? But that, our client loves every single product. With common, with, we have always sold everything. We offer besides, I think it's about time for a product line, extension and time to open a new branch. If you say so, but I don't want to hear you complain about having so much work. And I am not working overtime. 
If you think it's going to work, going to work, you're probably right. Excellent. Thank you very much. Good job. Let's give them an applause. Thank you, me. Excellent. Thank you. I'm proud of you, but my goodness, what is happening? Okay, just a few corrections. Decided, decided, sales, young, young man, young man. Let's see. Now let's go with Ramiro. And let's see. Julio Aguillon. Ramiro, you start. Dad, I've decided to launch uh, the new Papa Sandwich. It is going to make our brand more popular and capture more sales. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papa Burger. Papa's fry, papa salad, papa chicken, etc. Come on, young man. Have you lost your mind? But dad, our clients love every single product we've come, come up with. We have always sold everything we offer. Besides, I think it's about time for a product line extension and time to open a new branch. If you say so, but I don't want to hurt you complain about having so much work. And I know working overtime, if you think it's going to work, you're probably right. Excellent. Good job. Let's give them an applause. That was good. Excellent. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank let's you, use Miss. Just a few corrections. Popular. Popular. Capture. Capture. And here. Here. Correct. Popular. Okay. Popular. Got you. Okay, here. excellent. Now, here's the thing. And I have seen this because I'm with you, well, with some of you. I don't know. How long have I been your teacher? Para ustedes, hace cuánto soy su teacher? Para, para algunos que están conmigo desde hace, like, I don't know. Desde primer grado. Volume number four? Module number four for some. Yep, like yeah. four, five, six, first, second, like so five modules already. Four, five modules, yeah. Yeah, I think like five oh, modules. Yeah. It is weird. Yeah. Or four, something like that. Four six. or five. Four or five. Yeah. Yeah, it's something like that. So I can tell you for the ones that have been with me before, you have improved. Okay. You have improved. Even though if I had you last module and then I have you today in this module, you have improved. Yes. But here is the situation. You have good pronunciation now. You have a better pronunciation because you remember the first times you were reading conversations that I, a lot of excess, like blah, 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 a lot of mispronunciations. But now you have a few mistakes. You're right. Now. But the thing that I want you to improve is the intonation, okay? And that's why we go to the break rooms because it's different when I start to speak English like this. If I want to say something in English, but I have to think, to think, to think, and I am, speaking like this it is very different you see if you hear me speaking like that you will be like eh, that's my teacher eh. yeah that's not a good teacher next please <laughs> exactly, exactly exactly if you hear me speaking like that you will be like eh, nah i don't trust her i don't like that i don't like that where is Sofia Vergara? Where is Sofia Vergara, right? Like speaking like that, oh my goodness. Now, the thing is, I need you to improve your pronunciation, your intonation. Pronunciation, pretty good. Intonation is what I want you to improve because with the intonation, we give feelings. Like we can, I can see the feelings, right? It's different. It's very different. For example, let's, Let's do an example with this conversation. Here in this part, it says, 
Come on, young man. Have you lost your mind? This one is like, vamos, jovencito. ¿Has perdido la cabeza? Como like, ¿estás loco? Jovencito, young man. Like, joven, hombre joven. So, let's read this without intonation. Okay? This without intonation. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papas burger, papas fries, papas salad, papas chicken, etc. Come on, young man, have you lost your mind? Nah, thank you. Now, with intonation. Alejandro, we sell so many products already. Papas burger, papas fries, papas salad, papas chicken, etc. Come on, young man, have you lost your mind? Was it different? Was it different? Yeah, it was different. Intonation. Like this house. Intonation. <clears throat> Intonation. That's why when I send you to the breakout rooms, you have to practice intonation. Because you practice like no son nada las señoras aquí en mi pueblo rezando like right like and you do perfect right but the intonation the feeling where is the feeling you see that's why we want that's what we want to change in English okay I remember when I lived in the United States in this um lady from the United States. She, I, don't, I, I don't like to call them Americans because we all live in America. That's crazy. Anyways, so this lady told me, when you speak in English, you sound really serious. But when you speak in Spanish, you sound like you're having fun, right? And I was like, uh -huh. I didn't think of that. That's why people say we have a different voice. People say that when we speak English, it's a different voice. And when we speak Spanish, it's a different voice. It's weird. I don't know why, but it's weird. But it's because the feeling. We become a different person in English and a different person in Spanish, right? So that's why I want you to improve intonation. You're about to go to advanced level, okay? And in advanced level, you don't want to be like, like I, t I have told you this before. In Spanish, ustedes cuando hablan con las personas, sus amigos no dicen, hola, Mario, ¿cómo estás? Yo estoy muy bien. ¿Y tú cómo te encuentras? Yo me encuentro bien. Gracias por preguntar. Bueno, nos vemos, amigo. Nos vemos. Who speaks like that? My God, nobody. <laughs> Ni los niños Discovery se han atrevido a tanto. My God. <laughs> Oh my God, nobody speaks like that. So like, hey, ¿qué onda, man? ¿Qué onda? Ay, como te Ay, viera trabajando. Let's get... Like, you speak like that, right? So why in English, this is the thing that I want you to understand. Cuando empiezan a leer esas conversaciones, así, así los escucho. Right? Vamos, joven, has perdido la mente. Ya vendemos mucho. Like, that's not how they do it. No, my God, right? Hasta los, los que hacen los doblajes al español neutro le ponen más feeling. My goodness, no. Right? So that's what I want you to do. Listen. Practice intonation. Feelings. Right? Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think you tried to tell us so we, we sound more nature with that conversation nature and just just um start with with a uh, intonation nature mm -hmm. a conversation nature yeah that's what i want you to do angela i want you to sound more native when I'm speaking okay i don't want you to sound so it's exactly like a like a native person in it and i try to to be a person who I know the, the, the knowledge in English. Correct. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Correct, correct. Because besides of reading, sometimes when you're not reading and you're thinking, translating in your mind, you're like, um, um, and I want, um, 
Um, and you're doing that, right? You're doing that. Um, este, and you put muletillas in Spanish when you're speaking in English. Este, este, um, um, and do it like that, right? So that's what I want you to change. Feelings, feelings in English. Smile when you're speaking. Get angry when you're speaking, right? Don't be like, este, este, I want to eat. Um, este, how do you say pizza in English? Pizza. Oh, okay. I want to eat pizza. Right. So, you, you know, like, I don't want you to be like that. I want you to be more fluent, right? Fluency. That's what we're practicing. Practicing fluency and intonation, right? So, why am I telling you this? Because when I go to the breakout rooms, I want you to be practicing not only pronunciation, but also intonation. You got it? Yes, miss. Okay. And this is the different thing now. A few modules ago, for example, remember when you were in basic level one, you didn't understand the teacher. If the teacher was speaking only in English, maybe you were not able to understand everything. But now, when you hear me, you understand more, right? Okay, wow. because you have practiced a lot of listening. Now, what do you have to practice more? To speak. Correct. That's it. Okay. That's what I want you to think. We have to practice speaking. Okay. Perfect. Let's continue. Now, we read the conversation already. So we know what they are talking about and everything. So have we have a few questions down here below. We have three questions. The first one is, what are Alejandro and his father talking about? Number two is, is Alejandro's dad enthusiastic? enthusiastic about his son's suggestion suggestion and number three have they both come to an agreement about the expansion of their product line so based on the conversation we have here we're going to answer these questions if you could take a screen. excuse me miss yep what do you mean what mean boot both. Have they boot? Both. Both. Like uh, two people, both. Like um, ambos. Uh, they uh, uh, ambos. both Correct. come to agreement para estar uh, de acuerdo acerca de la expansión de su línea de productos. Hey, gracias. Correct. That's what it means. Yep. Okay. Excellent. Let's see. So based on this, we're going to answer these questions. Okay. Based on the conversation. Okay. Let's do it. Please let's join the breaker rooms, please. Mayra, just well, Jocelyn's listening. Mayra.
Okay, okay. Two more minutes and then we come here to share the answers. Okay, welcome back. Let's see. Let's go with the first question. What are Alejandro and his father talking about? Let's see, we're gonna ask this question to Johnny. What are Alejandro and his father talking about? They are talking about launch the new product. Okay, okay. Johnny, choose the next participant and ask the next question, please. Okay. Next is chun, 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 chun. Ana Veronica. Okay, ask. Is Alejandro that enthusiastic about his song suggestion? No, para mi Okay. Um, no, he said he thinks that they already have a lot of product lines. Excellent. Thank you very much. Ana, choose the next participant and ask the next question, please. Monica? Mm -hmm. 
Monica, uh, yeah, question. Have they both come to agreement about the expansion of the growth line? Uh, no, uh, he said John uh, agreement about the expansion. Okay, okay. Does someone has a different opinion about the agreement? Thank you, Monica. Appreciate it. Do you think they got an agreement? What is an agreement? De acuerdo. Estar de acuerdo. Do you think they have an agreement? No. Llegaron a un acuerdo? Yes. No. Yeah, they did. Yeah, finally, part. finally, finally, yes. Yeah, he said that he can do it, right? But he won't work extra hours. He's not we working all the time. Yes. Okay, so he can do it. He said that he can do it, but the dad is not working overtime, right? And he doesn't want to listen to the son complaining about having to work a lot. Yes. Okay. Now let's just do a brief explanation of what is the present perfect. The present perfect is actually pretty simple. It's not confusing at all. And it's pretty simple to understand. The present perfect. Mostly we use it to talk about experiences experiences that was what we're going to be talking about and we use auxiliaries for they we use the auxiliary wait i mean sorry they i you and we we use the auxiliary have and for he she and it we use the auxiliary? Us. us. Us, correct. That's it. Then, we have different rules. The first one is the rule for affirmative statements. It's subject plus have or has. I'm sorry. Have or has plus the verb, and the verb goes in the past participle. And then we have a complement, right? This is the rule for the affirmative statements. Now, pretty simple to do. We're going to do an example with this. I have played soccer before, right? This will be the example. Now, to make a negative statement is easier. Now, the only thing that you have to add is not. You can say not with contraction or separated. For example, the statements I have played soccer, or what, what, what is this? I have played soccer before in this form will be I have not or haven't, right? Haven't played soccer before, okay? Now, to make questions, Ramiro, tell me your question. Excuse me, miss. I I think it's a contradiction. This is if the present perfect, but use the past participle and wife not use Present participle, no exist, no, no, no use. No, the Excuse form of, the, no, it, it, I, I understand your question. Um, It's called the past participle because that's the way the, the verbs are called. Ese es el nombre de los verbos. Present, past, and past participle. Present, past, and past participle. And actually the we're talking about perfect. a situation in the past. But use the present perfect. 
Correct. With this, uh, uh, um, in the past participle. <laughs> yeah, that's the name. Even in Spanish, it's el presente perfecto in Spanish as well. Y los verbos son el pasado participio. Yeah, the same thing. <laughs> It's how me. they is how they did grammar. Grammar yes. books. Yes, it's English it's... grammar. In English. Spanish too. Spanish is complicated, more complicated. <laughs> but, uh, but I grammar mean, is I have, my bad. I have dream. playing. No. Use ing no. in the principal no. verb. No, it's I have has jugado, played. ado, edo. Yes, it has jugado. Pass. It's, it's okay. past participle in Spanish, too. Okay. Subject ever. Have you ever the verb in the past participle? Yeah, I get it. But don't complicate yourselves, okay? It's not that complicated. Plus a complement, plus a question. In this case, we're going to use ever. Ever is like to ask alguna vez, right? So, have you ever played soccer? And then we have two possible answers. Yes, I have. Or? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Do you remember now this topic that we have been practicing, like, since, I don't know, like. I have, I have a question, excuse me. Yeah. Um, the response, uh, large response is yes, answer, I have. Answer, answer. Uh, answer excuse me. Uh, uh, the large um, answer is yes, I have. I have ever played soccer. Yes, I or have played. played. Yes, I have played soccer before. Played? No, played. 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 Okay. Okay. Yes, Thank I you. have played soccer. Or yes, I have played soccer before. Both are correct. Thank you. Yeah. But short answers, yes, I have. No, I haven't. But if you want to say like a complete answer with all the stuff, yes, I have played soccer before when I was young and things like that, whatever. Yep. Thank you, Miss. Okay. Do you have more questions, you guys? That's a no. So I'm guessing if you don't have any more questions, that means that this topic is pretty clear for you. Yes? <laughs> so, so? Ah, you're not asking questions. So I'm, 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 I'm guessing it's pretty, it's pretty clear. So on Monday, probably. On Monday, <laughs> probably. On Monday, we're going to be practicing this topic, okay? Again, yes? Thank you, Miss. Okay, we need for... you have a good... Un Kahoot for practice. Oh, you need a Kahoot to practice. Hmm, how convenient. <laughs> yes, Miss. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, let's go with the last attendance because I know we all want to go to Mimir. Me, for example. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Present, Miss. Denis Enrique Saldaña Claros. Present. Blanca Isabel Tunaca de Rodríguez. Present. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Present, Miss. Joseas Figueroa Cisneros. Present, Miss. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Rafael Antonio Martínez Navarrete. Present, Miss. Nice to see you. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Walter Vladimir Martínez Rosa. Mayra Patricia Artiga Vázquez. Present, Miss. Jocelyn Angelina Ramírez Melgar. Johnny Alexander Escobar Calderón. Present, Miss. Silvia Patricia Aceituno Méndez. Present, Miss. Mónica Wendy Ávalos Girón. Present. María Julia Ramos Olívar. Present, Miss. Ángela Guadalupe Hernández Sánchez. Present, Miss. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Present, Miss. Hey, I just want to remind you something antes de que se vayan, porque ya aquí se empiezan a conectar antes de que. Recuerden que si faltan 20 minutos y siempre se conectan a las 8 y 20, un, después de, quiero ver, después de seis clases, ya perdieron una clase completa. ¿Yes? 
porque ya suman 120 minutos. Entonces, si intentamos conectarnos on time, porque si no van a ir perdiendo. 10 clases, 12 clases que se conecten 10 minutos tarde, ya son una clase completa que han perdido. So, please, try to be on time. Julio César yeah. Aguillón Arevalo. Present. Jennifer Esmeralda Maya Arias. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present, Miss. Gerson Alexi Funes Sosa. Omar Set García López. Galicia López. Amado Javier Urrutia Rivera. Present, Miss. Okay, excellent. That will be it for today. And I will see you guys on Monday. Remember to work on the platform, okay? Okay, Miss. Bye. Have a good yes. night. Yes. Have a good night. See you on Monday. Have a good, okay. night. Okay. Good, have a good weekend. Bye. Have a good weekend. Bye. Great weekend for you, Miss. Bye for you too. Bye bye. Bye. -bye. bye.